The month of May has finally arrived and brings a new artist to the Niagara Pump House Art Center. Two uh, titles uh, for two different series, uh, but they come together as one through light and texture. So the first one is Pathway, and that's the series that have element of trees. Uh, and the other one is called Beyond the Horizon. And how would you describe your style of artwork? I'm definitely a painter, but uh, because my focus is so uh, much on texture and light, and it's been like that for many years, I would say that it's mixed media technique, mainly oil. Now, is this your first showing at the Pump House? Yes, that's the uh, first showing at Pump House. It started actually last year when I was asked to offer my art programs here as an instructor. So I started teaching first here and then uh, one of the board members, Carol, asked me to have a solo show. So that's my first. And are you excited? Yes, I am excited. I will be more excited, I think, when I see people coming. And of course, I would love to sell some of my artwork. But yeah, it's very exciting that Pump House is offering beautiful space for such shows. And it's very, very good atmosphere here. So I'm very happy the way that everything turned out and was set up. Now, of the pieces on display here, do you have any favorites? My favorites probably would be in the front, the pieces that I showed you, in search of the rose. Uh, but here, in a specific room, I would say that uh, it's called Land Beyond the Sea, and it refers to the place where, um, where we would experience that uh, inner uh, transformation and renewal of, of inner... Uh, Selves. And what would you say are your main sources of inspiration when you sit down to do a painting? My main source of inspiration, it's always been my face. And because of my face, uh, it's God. So uh, it's that divine inspiration. Uh, for me, um, God himself is the artist because of the creation. So uh, as I look for inspiration from the creation, like nature, I always keep in mind that the creation did not create it itself, that uh, the artist was behind that creation. So, so that's my source of inspiration. Yeah, I just only hope that uh, I'm just kind of reflection of, of, of that in my work, through my work. The opening reception for Beata's Pathways and Behind the Horizon series will be held Sunday, May 4th from 2 to 4 p.m. Her artwork will be on display here at the gallery until June 2nd. Reporting in Niagara-on-the-Lake, I'm Katie Jones for The Source.